I'm posting another YouTube video. Um, I guess this would be my second one today. I did another one, but I didn't post it. But I just wanted to say guys are asses, and that's a fact. Um, I am a single black female. Um, single, is it by choice to some extent? But it's like um, I'm being left behind. Time is fleeting, and I'm like stuck, stuck with a rest, like a lot of the other um, black females or whatever. And should I say African American females? Anyway, you black. So it's like um, I don't know what it is. I can't quite put my finger on it. A lot of people like to say a whole bunch of different things. People like to make up all kinds of excuses as far as why black women aren't married. Put it to you like this. Black people, the damn black family is almost like non-existent. People don't put like a, a great emphasis on family. Um, crack help with that. And it's like people now in general have this idea that, you know, it's okay to have kids or whatever and not be married. Or, you know, later on down the line, sometimes they get married. But it's like, and then some women have the attitude, well, you know, I don't need a man or whatever to raise my kid. Yeah, stupid. You don't need a man to raise your kid, but the kid needs a man because women can't raise boys and men can't raise um, girls. A man can't teach a, a, a girl how to be a woman and a woman can't teach a, a boy how to be a man. Bottom line, I don't care what the hell y'all saying. And if you think that you can use an ass. So, and I'm speaking from experience. I never said that I didn't need a man or whatever because I know my son need one. So, looking at it from that point of view, which is the right point of view, your children need a mother and a father um, if all the gay people watching this, um, how do you think you got here? Man, woman, regardless of what your gender is, what your sexual orientation is, what you want to be, what you call yourself, how you think you got here? Okay. Ain't no in vitro, no cloning, nothing. How do you think you got here? Okay. Bottom line. So on that note, back to what the hell I was saying. Yeah, so single black female. Single black female, and I'm going to say this again, and I've said this before. I don't even know if I had the videos posted, but I'm like strictly old school and trying my best not to sleep with anybody if I'm not married to them. And it's a good rule to follow. Um, it'll keep you drama free for the most part. You'll be lonely, but it'll keep you drama free. If you don't have any diseases, if you're not sleeping with anyone, you won't have to worry about catching anything. Um, won't have to worry about getting pregnant, even though, even though if you have like, um, oh, I learned this is sexual contact. You don't have to have penetration, but sexual contact. Um, if anybody's genitalia touches your genitalia, it doesn't have to be like any type of insertion, but it's like if it rubs up against it, if you're rubbing each other, whatever, and you're both like naked down there, you still could catch something. And of course you can get, um... I guess if they come, excuse me, ejaculate or whatever, like near there or whatever, sometimes the stuff could just like, if they're that strong, I guess swim up there into the vaginal um, canal or whatever you want to call it. But yeah, anyway, I digress. So I just wanted to say that, and no, I didn't really say why we aren't married, but it's like um, people not putting it, um, they're not stressing the fact that the black family's falling apart. Everybody want to point fingers and all this other crap. And black women want to say they aren't any good black men. And people want to say men are in jail. And all this other stuff. But it's a whole combination of all that stuff. And plus, a lot of black men marry people of different races. And, you know, people of different races aren't trying to marry anybody black. They marry everybody else. We're the last people on the totem pole to get married. And I don't want to hear nobody talking about some, oh, I'm wrong, this and that and the other. If you're black, um, and if you're saying this, then maybe you're married to something or whatever. But I know otherwise. I see a lot of people get married or whatever. I see a lot of people with women of different races, and not, of the, not a lot of them are with us. Everybody else except us. Okay? 
So I see a lot of that, and especially like in a 30, 40 range or whatever. So it's this is an epidemic. And, you know, all the dialogue or whatever between black men and black women. Bottom line is people need to commit. They don't want to commit. Everybody want to just go screw each other. Women want to screw the men and men want to screw um, women and all willy-nilly without any type of commitment. And even if they do commit, they don't want to get married and all this other stuff. If everybody stop fucking each other um, outside of marriage, then you have a lot more people get married. Bottom line. But since everybody wants to fuck, then, you know, it's just that. Excuse the profanity. Lord, forgive me. And I guess I'm running over because I never make videos longer than uh, five minutes, but this is almost six. Thanks, YouTube. I'm going to post this right now.